After walking and hitchhiking for quite some time, I made my way to Cass Lake, where Stony Point Resort is located. And I hung out here. I found myself here. Someone dropped me off, and I decided to camp out for a while. It's a beautiful, beautiful resort on a lake, and I kept hearing murmurs from everybody around about some fishing tournament. So I decided to camp out and stay for a while just to see what was going on. And while I was camped out in this spot right here, uh, a couple of fellas moved into a camp spot right here. Those two fellows were JR and his fishing partner, Marty, uh, two professional fishermen. And this is when I found out that this tournament is big leagues, boys. We're talking Cabela's Walleye Fishing Tournament. That's a big, that's a big most, deal. Most weight, it wins. It's just the way it is. It's not inches, it's weight. So you're And fish sometimes you can get a short fish that's fat. Yeah, and then fat you want to do some math quick. Number one thing is to get five weighable fish. Yeah, you five want, counters. You want five counters. And in then the if you can do that, you might be you're look, you might be looking good. The next day, I was invited onto the boat to watch them pre-fish the lake for the tournament, and they threw so much knowledge at me it was bananas. Play, it's got a spinner and, uh, blade, to, yeah, yeah, two uh, hooks, you put a night crawler, right worm on that, home tie it on, and you pull it at uh, one and a half miles an hour behind the boat. Yeah, and nice now I gotta wait in here, so it sits here, like that. So this bounces off the bottom, and this will float and spin behind. There was trolling, there was jigging, there was all these different kinds of rigs, there was plastic bait and live bait, there was just so much going on there was so much technology on this boat and so like i didn't even know where to start being somebody who had knows almost nothing about fishing all i knew was that this stuff was big there's these other pro guys out there behind me and he's fishing right kind of in the same spot they're really shallow yeah they're eight they're eight feet he's like 13 feet a bit of a drop off over here a lot of money on the line. Unfortunately, we didn't catch any walleye while we were out there. And it seemed to be the common thread with everybody who was pre-fishing the lake. But hopefully for the competition, things will be different.